it's Ashton. And it's John. What up, guys? We're back with another action video. In today's video, we're going to be reacting to... Owen Benjamin Rance gets God, get a baby, and shut up! Yes. Um, this was a suggestion for Rom, Black Ops Elf. Thank you so much. Just making sure it is you. Yes, it is. And also, the last video that you suggested, man, which is the Max 5... I didn't actually see your comment through Streamlabs because we were just trying to, like, get to your name. Because John's a lazy bitch. It says co-op four-player, and it's also available in VR, which that makes it a fucking lot better because VR is amazing when it that comes to games like that. Fun, huh? Yes. Um, you guys can also help support our channel, just like um, Black Ops Elf did. Click on the link down below in the description if you guys want $10. We'll also react to a video that you pick. Keep it under 10 minutes. Click the video link title at your email. Let's get to this Follow video. Follow on Instagram, and let's get to my arms just to go, da -da 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 -da. I got fat, jiggly arms. Owen Benjamin, go and subscribe if you guys <laughs> like this. I'm so lame. Sorry. You're fine. They're You're one fine. false. It's because of this, it's because, okay, they, they want to double the taxes, right? So they want to get women to work. That's why Barack Obama, this the savior of, of, of mankind, spread vicious propaganda lies the wage gap is is mathematically not true and everybody knows it <laughs> yes why do they do that because they want women to think that being a woman is defined by work and what happens when you go to work you don't have kids and if you do you you, you don't raise them and you definitely have fewer kids uh, so what happens then? Then women now pay taxes. So now you've, you've increased your tax base. Now you don't have a family structure, right? And when you have a family structure, you can rely on each other. So you don't need these giant social fucking nets that don't give a shit about you. And it's a, it's just an embezzlement scheme. All right. So then, so what happens then? It's just like, oh God. And they don't even see it. So then all these women don't have kids, right? So they work their ass off because they think that's empowerment. And then when, of course, the other thing that's empowerment is Planned Parenthood, which is ripping life out of their womb once they create the life, okay? So they have two or three fucking abortions in their 20s, fuck early that. 30s. Two or three. To, you know, make it Yo, fuck that. There's people out there that are having abortions every time they get pregnant just because they use that as a form of birth control instead of condoms or anything else. Fuck that. True that. That's a, I had to make sure that the video was actually up as much money as possible because right, that's what womanhood is defined by by authoritarian giant government people right so because they just want to take more money and have more control because that's what bernie sanders that fucking liar is feel the but burn what happened. <laughs> then women realize that they should have had when kids and they have this emptiness that follows them everywhere they go and that no matter what they do it doesn't fill it like I've, i know chelsea handler i've done her show five times like i'm not just this random spectator i watch someone be cool and fun and slowly become a fucking psychopath. Chelsea Handler at 30 was really cool. Chelsea Handler at 40 something is a nut job. And you see this over and over. Amy Schumer used to be really cool. I shot a Butterfinger commercial with her. She's let me stay at her apartment. I've done her fucking TV show. The chick was a rock star. And then you watch them age. And then you watch them think that they have to baby everyone. And that everything is about safety. And everything is about not saying the wrong word and not hurting feelings. You know what that's good for? Babies! True that. You idiots! Like, that quality is, is good in a woman when you're dealing with a one-year-old in an electric socket. But they didn't <laughs> fucking have babies. Sarah Silverman didn't have... None of these people had babies. Holy shit. So they baby everybody else. And you know what that leads to? Genocide. And everyone, no one fucking cares. It's the same thing that happens with men. You take a warrior, right? You take a warrior man, a man genetically designed to, to protect, and you give him no mission, that's, that's death to society. Death. You take a bunch of knights, you take a bunch of warriors, you take a bunch of men in the prime of their life, ready for battle, for work, for protection, for love, for, for earning and you give them nothing. You know what you get? ISIS. You think that they're that much different than us? Oh, shit. You know, I make fun of Muslim shit all the time, but on a genetic, biological, deep, emotional, human level, that's us. Just, just born into a shit world. Like, we could be ISIS. You want to know what happens? With, you want to know how that happens? You give a bunch of men no purpose. No purpose. You give a bunch of women fucking potato sacks. You know? 
You, you cut off these human beings from humanity, and then what happens? Then they're susceptible to some crazy person whispering in their ear, I'll give you purpose. You're a man to Allah. If you die, everyone will know you're a man. You'll die for a reason. That shit, that, those suicide bombers, man, you don't think I have empathy for them? That a lot of those guys just wanted a wife that loves them and that's someone that they love. They want a mission. They want to fucking build a garden. They want to kill a snake who's trying to kill their fucking baby. But instead, Damn. they don't have that. So what do they do? They don't listen know about to nonsense this, and they blow themselves into bits. That instinct is good. It's just weaponized by fucking psychopaths. That's true, man. It's happening to American women right now. These women never got to have kids. And some of them are like, oh, I'm now I'm too old. I can't even freeze my eggs because I'm not rich enough. I didn't make enough money. But you're ISIS. You're now fucking crazy. And do all women need kids? No. Oh, you're, you're so now you're, and then they say shit. They say shit to grown men like me. They say stuff like, oh, you're acting out. You've been acting out a lot lately. I mean, you just attack people. But I'm like, do you think I'm a one-year-old? Do you know who talks that way? Moms. I'm a 37-year-old man with 100,000 Twitter followers, a house I own, a car I own, a wife who loves me, a baby, another kid on the way. I'm a fucking legend. You don't talk to me like I'm one. Go get your own fucking baby. Damn. You treat society that way. No one grows. No one learns. Right? You make everybody a fucking infant. You think you can understand Socrates? You think you can understand the market economy? No, you become this fucking blob. And you see it everywhere. You see these blobs. And now we have a generation of kids raised without a fucking mother because the mom's on Twitter talking about how Donald Trump is the snake in the Garden of Eden, right? Get God, get a baby, and shut your fucking mouth. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Damn, he is pissed. I actually, you know... A lot of that is some good shit. Like, I don't know. The whole, like, ISIS it. part, though, is you always got a choice to make, and maybe you are ran by somebody who's a fucking psychopath but you had the choice to join them at the time yeah but that's, that part that's was like, the only part i was like that's kinda like, like saying about. we're you know like men here are in the service and you're not you know you're doing what is good for our country and they're being told that that's what's good for them and maybe you know what i mean like i get what you're saying yeah kind of like that how, makes sense yeah. kind of like how like in you know world war World War II, you know, with Hitler and stuff, and it's like they were they, they were being ran by or the, you know, Hitler and following Zafira. him because, he, because yeah, like it's it's kind of like that in a way it's like you do what you're told to do because you're supposed to follow them. And if you or, don't, you get killed. Yeah, so. And your family does. <laughs> yeah, so I mean in a way it's understandable. I actually do like that video. I think that, that the amount of what, what I, would you call it compassion he has for the subject I guess mm-hmm. is that, is that, word, does that yeah. sound good um, I mean like you could tell that he obviously had a lot of like I don't compassion know compassion for the yeah. subject I mean you already you worded it tell, you got it again you could tell that he was really like bothered by it but it makes sense it really does it does yes um, cause it's like people are like with society now and all the like younger generations they're like babying them all and like women and i don't know there's a lot of different subjects i guess you could talk about but people are trying to change so many different things it's like dude just grow up just grow up just like what he's saying you know just grow up stop being a baby true that because that's the only way he's right that's the only way that people are actually going to change stop treating them like babies because they're not they're full grown people and you just got this mindset that you're going to treat them like that I never really thought about it that way either until I heard him say Mm -hmm. that Um, guys go and subscribe to um, that was Owen Benjamin 194,000 subscribers that's a hell of a lot and we will catch you in the next video peace